on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Where is it? Where? What? What? Why? Uh, where is the fucking book? A book? Oh, my grandma! Oh, that's... I misplaced it. So, hand it over. Right now. I... I... I like I said, I, I misplaced it, so help me if it turns out that... Bleeding... Fucking imp has it. I... Will... Now I remember. Yes, I I took it to uh, the cleaners, the drug cleaners. What? Yes, yes, I I remember completely now. Yes. Well, well, but Bridget, why do you need it? I'm going to blow off some steam, and I need it. So hand it over right now. It's going to take a while, my dear. You have to the count of three to procure the book. Or else I'll show you how much harder a woman's scorn can be than hell's very fire. <coughs> <sighs> if you'll excuse me, I'm going to... The dry cleaners. Here it is. <laughs> uh, you're welcome. I didn't say thank you. As yes, still in a pissed off blind rage, heads into the MHA world. You almost be the only way. Wait, but there isn't there an Earth there? Yes, but you must remember. Souls can travel to whatever dimension he wants, especially when that book. So, yeah. Her pretty much destroying a bunch of shit. Breaking a lot of things. To the point where, yeah, heroes are called, the police are called. Her still pissed, yelling that. Her husband cheated on her with an imp. Everyone's wondering why. Uh, I get a cheating part, but an imp? What? what like, excuse me? What, what? What's an imp? So, yeah. Then Izuku shows up. Him doing his best to calm her down is not working until she starts throwing shit at him. And it gets weird. Because then he starts using Black Witch to restrain her. And she's... she's <coughs> yeah, she, she ain't hating it. So, yes. Izuku trying to take her into custody. But her... Her voice is hella loud. And uh, people are starting to stare. So yes, after he releases her, she pretty much drags him to the nearest motel room. Him, wait, wait, wait what are you doing? You can't be that stupid. I'm going to bang you. Wait, what? Here? Oh, yes, you're right. This place is... just dr dreadful. Her dragging him to a hotel room. A five-star hotel. The only thing is, after they get there, Izuku, he's calling for backup. The only ones that can show up are Araka, Froppy, and you see where I'm going with this. Let's just say that was a very fulfilling day of hero work.
Stella, she is a lot more calm. But as when Izuku wakes up while she's trying to dip, she's like, fuck. <sighs> Uh, where are you going? Um, I feel a lot better now. Thank you. Wait, what? We already, I already got what I need for the day. So what? What? What is it? Apparently, you're having problems with your marriage, and yes, you think cheating. Well. No, actually, I just go and destroy more stuff, but I didn't want to ruin my house, so I went here. Uh, that is very selfish and rude. Does it look like I care? Uh, no, I suppose not. But still, whatever. You yeah, have no right to talk about my marriage. You know n nothing. Well, I won't know anything unless you tell me. Like, come on, let's let's talk. Ugh. You are one of the most talkative one night stands I have ever seen. Uh, uh um, uh, whatever. Fine, let's. Let's talk. Ah, okay. I see what's going on here. So, well, where you're from, your society, imps are low, like, they're pretty much for manual labor. And they're lower on the totem pole, especially just one of your high status. Yes, and he had the gall, or he's as you put it, the balls to actually sleep with one. Yes. So, hmm. Okay. But from hearing about your past, it sounds more like you, um, you, your marriage was doomed already. Huh? Like, has he seen this imp again? Uh, I... I don't know. Well... Maybe you should ask him. Listen. I don't need you to try to be my shrink or whatever. I just need to blow off some steam in which you and your friends are were kind enough to help me with. Mirko just waking up so you're too loud, shut up. Either way Thank you for a lovely evening. Come on, just just stay at least for breakfast or something. Like, oh, I don't eat that commoner's food. It's like, oh no, we have some good food here. Trust me. I really don't want to. Oh come on. I I've I know where that mouth's been, and trust me, that the food is not gonna be worse. Excuse me? Your mouth ain't so clean either. <coughs> well, this isn't about me. This is about you, Miss Stella. Just, just call me Stella. It doesn't matter. Because soon I leave, <laughs> I'm not seeing you ever again. Wow, was I that bad? No, you... You did good. You... I, at least, considering that we're the only ones up, I, I'm not so sure 
if I was... No, no, it's just... I'm more resilient than most weak, pathetic, lower than mediocre. Okay, okay, damn. It's like humans. Huh? But, but seriously, why you, why you say it like that? I'm from hell. I am a demon from hell. One of the high demons, to be more specific, way... Hell is real? Yes. I slept with a demon? Well, not just you. Uh, dude. Um. Damn, I should have got some rippers. Some what? Oh, you mean those things that keep you from uh, procreating? No. <laughs> Uh, trust me, if I wanted to be knocked up again, I would have allowed it. What? Oh yes, I can keep myself from procreating, especially if there's someone I don't deem worthy. But looking back, I should... <sighs> Wait. So, wait, do you have... Yes, we do. We have a daughter named Octavia. Oh, how old is she? That is none of your business. Stop being so nosy. Stop worrying about me. Why? Because... Uh... Hmm. But yeah, from what I hear from your past before this bombshell drop got dropped on you, it seems like Stolas was not very happy anymore. Heck, it sounds like you weren't really enjoying yourself in your marriage either. Maybe you should consider marriage counseling? Are you... There is no way in hell I'm... Well, what's the worst thing that could happen? We get divorced. So? Excuse me? Seriously, sometimes that's the best option or least for some adults who don't get along anymore if you if it doesn't work out yes it's better just to get out of a bad relationship than it is to stay in a are you saying my marriage is going down the drain yes first with him sleeping with an that makes so much more sense the way you keep saying imp, this, imp, that, yeah, that makes more sense considering that you just said, yeah, you, you're you from literal, honest God hell. Huh. Well, at the very least, I will take your words into consideration. Hmm. Huh. But... There will be an issue. Also, there's nothing for you to worry about. At the very least, goodbye. And, yeah, just goodbye. Ah. <sighs> hmm. Marriage counseling, huh? All right, everyone, wake up. Five more minutes. Ugh, come on, Froppy. Come on, time to wake up. Ugh. My tongue is tired. Uh, Oraka? Uh, sure, I'm going to be sick. 
Oh, you shouldn't have used your quirk so much. Well, I couldn't help it. Here we go. I will kick her ass if you don't stop that yelling. Uh, Kendo? Just let us go. Just, just. Come on, we hit class. We don't care. Uh, Setsuna? You. That there, I. I can't. I. I can't move any part of me right now. I'm tired. So, Stella, how, how was you? I slept with a human. Goodbye. Oh. oh, here's your book back, bastard. Oh, oh, um, uh, thank you, mom. You, mom, you you have to be. You can't be serious. You actually, yes, whatever. You think Chin, your dad is gonna? Well, at first I was gonna just destroy a bunch of things, but then someone caught my eye. You cheating is not the answer for when he thought marriage counseling. <laughs> he said the same thing. Who? Funny, didn't get his name. Did you just... <sighs> didn't even get his name. What if you end up pregnant? That won't happen. Trust me. There's no way I allow... Huh. But he was just... He just wants to stop asking so many stupid questions. What are you talking about? Well, for one, he kept asking me about my marriage and how it was going, trying to give me advice on my marriage. Uh, the audacity. It's so like you was trying to help, Mom. Well, I don't need his help. Well, it looks like you need his help before, considering that you ended up sleeping with him. I was just blowing off some steam. That's all. Yeah. Yes, of, of course. What did you say? Not out of jealousy. You were just blowing off some steam. But seriously, getting even is not the way. Your father slept with an imp. Are you mad that he cheated on you or that it was an imp? That it was an imp. So, if he did it with some other demons, like say one of your friends, you wouldn't have minded. Well, no, not really. But, but. Oh my god. Wait, what? Uh, nothing. I. Huh. <sighs> Maybe he was right. Mom, what are you talking about? Uh, nothing. It's just... He said there were problems with... Our... Uh, marriage, but I just... Waved it off, and... <laughs> he said that... Apparently, your father has been very happy, and neither have I, I guess. Mom, you should have gotten his name. Oh, he was just a one-night stand, it doesn't matter. It's better if we forget each other anyway, especially since I told him that hell was real and one that- What?! Wait, did you at least have a human disguise? A what? Oh, wait. No. Why would I? Uh, Mom. You 
can't just go fooling around on Earth without a disguise. Well, I just pretty much hit the jackpot when it comes to just popping up in a random world, or at least dimension. The one I found myself in had a lot of people that looked somewhat demonic. What?